Yo, what's up guys? Josh here. We're just out for a quick afternoon rip, enjoying this wonderful fall weather. I was about to rip a wheelie, but I wasn't sure if they're about it. Anyways, what I wanted to talk about today was the coaster wheelie. So, coaster wheelie, that's when you go past balance point and then you're just using the momentum and balancing the bike just past balance point in a wheelie. So, I really believe that this is a fundamental skill, or not believe, I know it is, for like anything you do stunt riding because you need to be able to go back past balance point and just kind of hang out over there. They're smiling. Oh, turn that all the way around. What I was saying is, when you're doing a coaster wheelie, <clears throat> you're gonna get to that point where you're just kind of riding the wheelie and cruising along, feeling for that like, just where you go a little back and the bike starts to feel weightless, that's gonna be balance point right there. So, to coast, you have to go just past balance point and then like I said you're just using the balance you're balancing and using the bikes momentum because you're no longer using the gas to balance the wheelie see if they like wheelies coaster So, like I said there, when you go back, as you saw, you go past balance point, past balance point, and then right there, you catch yourself with the brake, and coaster wheelies, you kind of have to pull in the clutch, because you're just letting the bike idle, so that's my preferred way of always doing it. We'll go hit one more. There's like my favorite little hill over here, just to, it's pretty smooth, and normally not too many people around. So, up, balance point, then back, clutch in, and now I'm using the brake. So, I was riding the brake all the way back. Also, when you're learning coasters, it helps to have a slight downhill also. Just because it helps keep your momentum up whenever you hit the brake, because when you're first learning them, I guarantee you're just going to be smacking, like hitting the brake a couple times. It, it is a scary feeling when <laughs> the bike all of a sudden just goes completely weightless and then it's all on your brake. So, <laughs> if you're at balance point and you're just hanging out and you want to progress further, the next step is to start practicing coasters. <laughs> coasters it's honestly my favorite trick it's just so much fun just to go just to go back and just balance the bike probably coasters and stoppies take it from me those are just like my two favorite things to do like stoppy <laughs> just so much fun oh shit what's up buddy what's up hey come here come here Come here. I'm not gonna hurt you. Come here. Come here. Not about it. Alright, so we'll just hit one more coaster just for the sake of this. Let's wait for this car. I really don't like to wheelie when there's cars in the opposite lane. Just because if I fuck up or something happens, it's like total death. So, just trying to play it safe. Big smiles. So, <laughs> recap. What we're gonna do. Got a slight downhill, step one, get the bike to balance point, you're riding in the wheelie, once you get to balance point, you're gonna bring the bike back a little more, make sure you are covering your brake always. Foot's on the back brake, right as you feel the bike start to get weightless, you pull in your clutch, and then everything from there is all on your foot brake, so you go back, balance point, once you get to balance point, a little bit more past it, a couple degrees, pull that clutch in, and then feel for the point where the bike starts to become weightless. Like, a really good way to practice it, right when you feel the bike start to become weightless, tap that back brake and bring it back down, just so it doesn't freak you out and you don't go for a full coaster the first time, so. Make sure the, I think these people are turning in here. I don't know. Alright, so, we're gonna go, balance point, a little bit past, pull in the clutch, and ride the brake. I'm bring it up. Balance point. 
Now back, past balance point, and now all we're doing is just on the brake. That's all it is. That one was a little sloppy, but whatever. A little scrape just for fun. All right, now that you guys had a little coaster lesson with me, uh, I'm gonna go see if I can get a couple quality wheelie reactions and whatever, just for fun. All right, what are we doing here? What are we doing here? All right, fuck this shit. I don't know, I don't know. I guess I'm gonna go over here, I guess. And then we'll swoop. Some people, man, some people. It's really hard to drive these days. It's really difficult. Oh shit. <laughs> Whoops. See, everybody just smiles when they look at the bike for some reason. Oh. I need to get like full 360 so I don't have to turn around anymore. Hit a couple circles real quick. I really need to learn how to Ralph Louie. I think I can do it. Ralph Louie is when you take your <laughs> inside foot and you put it on this peg, or your outside foot and put it on this peg and put your foot out. That one was pretty good. I stalled that. If I do a stop at every stop sign, I'll get pretty good at them. We having a birthday party up here? Damn. Why wasn't I invited? Ooh, that's pretty. Getting over here. Damn. Wow, this is pretty. Yeah, I gotta get a picture here. Definitely does not do it justice. Well, <laughs> thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the video as well as the absolutely gorgeous scenery that we have here in Aspen, Colorado. So, <laughs> if you guys liked the video today, please like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what else you guys would like to see in the future videos that I'll put out. But <laughs> until next time. Peace.